Hi, it's me. I know some of you have seen my posts about tracking my progress, my goals that I've reached, slimming down, what I've been doing. I know some of you know it's Beachbody, some people don't really pay attention to details, so I'm going to shove it in your face kind of right now really quickly. Um, I'm starting 21 Day Fix. Pretty, pretty easy. Everybody knows what that is. The benefit to doing 20 weight, 21 Day Fix when, with Beachbody and with coaches and with somebody you know is the support group. The support group makes a difference, and that's how I've been able to reach a lot of my goals so quickly is we're a group, like a family. We boost each other. We help each other find great recipes. You're not doing it alone. Uh, it's easier when you see someone else being successful to want to strive to reach that same level of success. It's easier to set a goal, reach it, and get applauded by everybody for doing so well. So 21 Day Fix Extreme is my next challenge. I'll do probably a few more videos in between. Two DVDs, change up the workouts for the week. You're not doing the same thing every day, which is what helps your body not get um, used to the workouts. Something different every day, challenging your core, lower, upper body, switches it up. Um, the extreme that I went with also comes with a bonus. Um, the fix challenge makes it pretty simple. Comes a little book, recipes, different things. Uh, I will say the biggest thing for me, some of these, a good amount of them do fish. I don't do fish. I hate fish. I think it's horrible. Um, so I substitute uh, with beans as my protein, or sometimes I'll just put a little bit of, of the six ounce steaks or six ounce chicken, anything like that. I mean, you can substitute. You don't have to stick to this like religiously. Sticking to it, following the guide is what helps you get the ultimate results. But if you don't eat fish, you don't eat fish. Pretty, pretty simple there. Tons of different recipes. Um, another portion fix explains the containers. The containers are not something you want to use every single day. You don't want to sit there and pack everything in these little containers. You can. Um, sometimes you don't have time. If you have kids, if you're on the go, if you're in a hurry, or if you're eating out, obviously you cannot be like, excuse me while I pack your food into these little containers before I eat it because that just looks strange. Once you've done it, once you play around with it, once you get used to what the amount of everything is that you need, then you can... You, you get an idea. You don't have to sit there and use the containers all the time. You can look at it and be like, oh yeah, I remember my red container is this much, so this is what I want. It's just learning how to control yourself and not eating up a whole plate of food that you have in front of you. It's not necessary. You don't need that much, and that's a lot of the problem with weight gain is that you're overeating. Another thing is if you're already working out, a big thing, resistance bands. Um, I had a couple of dumbbells and weights. They're great. The resistance bands are even better. Can you make your own for that? Mm -hmm. Is that yes, ma'am. Can you wait one minute? The resistance bands are even better. Um, I also have extra weights. I have a three and a four year old. I have 30 pounds and almost 40. So I have two extra weights there that help me work out as well. They think it's fun. My son loves watching the videos. My daughter tries to somewhat work out. So I there's really no excuse to say, oh, I can't do that, or I have kids, or I don't have time, or this and that. If you have 10 minutes, if you've got 40 minutes, every mother needs to make time for herself. If you have any time in your day to just wake up and do something, it should be to work out. If your kids are going to get up at 7, you know that. Get up at 6.30. Have your glass of water. Do your workout. Okay. By the time you're done, the kids are getting up. You can do everything else you need to do about your day. And you're probably thinking, what, is she crazy? I'm not going to get up any earlier than I have to. You'll appreciate it. You will love it. You'll get up, you'll do your workout, you realize you start feeling more energized, you're feeling better, you're feeling your whole body will just feel Mommy, rejuvenated. I get up in two minutes. You're already up, Bob. Yeah, I get up in three Shh. minutes. Can you wait one minute, please? Okay. Um, kids are crazy. I mean, they interrupt everything, every aspect of your life. You never have a moment where anything is just you. And moms kind of just sweep themselves under the rug when it comes to kids because you have so much to do. It's like the laundry, the dishes, cleaning, taking them to daycare, going to kindergarten, preschool, or even middle school, whatever age your child may be. 
picking up after them, just cleaning up after everybody pretty much is exhausting. But if you set a goal you and stick to it, you can reach it. I decided I was going to do this. I set a goal. I'm going to get up in the morning, whether I want to get out of bed or not. I'm going to push myself to get up, do my workouts, drink my shake, and get my day started. And it's been different since. And I really appreciate the fact that before I even started doing that, you know, I had a girlfriend doing Beachbody who was like, you know, I think you could do this if you want to join the group. Just kind of watch. You know, I watched everybody. I saw everybody's progress. It gave me an opportunity to look at the different programs. And she just kept reaching out. And that was that was key right there is reaching out because I finally said, yes, if she can do it, she has two kids, she works, I can do this. Anybody can do this. All you have to do is want to. And again, the big thing, like I said, is you can go get any of these programs that there's the Hard Corpse 21 Day Fix, um, Chisel Size. There's so many different programs and you can go in Amazon, eBay, purchase them and do them by yourself. But it's not going to be as effective as it is as when you do it with a coach, a friend, or even a little group of teammates that you like teammates I say people that you've just met who also do the program being supportive of each other and getting support is a big deal um, could you please stop from here please so here I am this is me day one 21 day fix I'm giving it a go this is well ooh, blushy. this is where I'm at And I'm getting ready to kick my ass into better shape. Why? Because I want to be healthy. I like I'm comfortable when I'm in shape. I want to be around for my kids. I don't want to feel like I'm gonna break after my kids jump on me. And they're only gonna get bigger. And I want to pick them up as long as I can and hold them for as long as I can. And if I'm in great shape and I'm at my best health, I can do that. I, even though my daughter will probably be taller than me by the time she's eight or nine, I still want to be able to pick her up. I don't want to say I'm sorry you're too big or my back hurts or whatever it may be. There's no excuses. There's no room for excuses. So that's my story. Join me. Follow me. Whatever you want to do. If you want to just give it a go on your own, go ahead. But believe me, your best results are going to be with help of someone else. So let's look forward to my next two possibly three videos throughout the journey I might do one once a week um, it's 21 day fix um, so maybe at the end of the week so I'll just do another video but keep following